Hello everybody, welcome to the round of 16 match between Andres Chaos and Yakustas um, Pirelles. I didn't know that Justice84 was Yak, um, but now I do. And he has got zero guard on his elves. That is the big weakness of this team. Um, he does have a wizard and he's taken a bribe as well. Yep, he's taken a bribe, that wasn't a kickoff event. He's taken a bribe and a, and a wizard. Um, I think the bribe is very optimistic. I guess it's so that he can throw a foul in if there's a pile, but seems very optimistic. I think probably an Apo would have been my choice, but there you go. Um, he's got 12 elves and he's doing some kind of weird dacker. It's not a, it's not a good dacker where, where you wouldn't get blitzed at all. He is gonna get blitzed. Um, in fact, he's getting pommed, so. It's a terrible, horrific Dakar. I mean, typical of Yak, really. Here, this Yak is a lunatic. Um, with all, with all due respect to Yak, <laughs> I like Yak, but he's a he's a mentalist. Look at that! Like he's <laughs> what is he doing? <laughs> Already, <laughs> like he's good at blood ball, but he he does some things, doesn't he? He do, he does some things that make you think, hmm. <laughs> and like you know, you can see just on the team itself, like going, okay, this one's an edge five leaper, but he's got two other leapers with edge three, with edge four. Like he's got he, he's got nerves. Like look at this thrower. He's got sure hands. Okay. Then leap and nose of steel. <laughs> it's just, just yak, isn't it? It's just yak. Yeah, he, uh, he does some things, but yeah, dak away. You get a guy claw pommed on turn one. Kind of defeating the point. He's dead. <laughs> Absolute justice. <laughs> Absolute justice there. Oh, this is brilliant. This is just, this is just vintage yak. Instant, instant vintage yak. Um. <laughs> I did fall from my bed. Yes, Jellio. Yep. This is this is live. The the uh, you can see the replay bar. That's only because they started early. Um, yeah. <laughs> um, so I'm I'm a little bit tired, but there you go. Um. Yeah. I mean, it's it's, it's a solid team as usual for Andre, right? Andre usually does the. The mighty first build, like he's called mighty first, he normally does mighty first, and he has done mighty first. Now we've got a proper Dakar, but it should have been done from turn one, and then he would have had one less dead elf. <laughs> Instead, one, two, three, four, five, six, we could see a GFI and a foul. I mean, this is a great play to foul, I would absolutely be gang fouling this. You've got 13 players, and Yak has no mighty blow at all. Um, so I would absolutely be putting in the GFI to gang foul this guy. Yep. Ter terrible belated Dakar. He could be down two players instead of none. <laughs> I guess he's got to be concerned about leaving open a hole here because Yak could push down the side I guess but not that concern is it you've got to get your foul in oh he doesn't remove him look a dog <laughs> just instantly stands him up he doesn't care that he's going to get surfed <laughs> uh, I guess no he's not going to get surfed necessarily is he He's got sidestep, but I mean, it's still easy to surf him, isn't it? But he's going all men's car. I, I, I officially give up on trying to understand Yak. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> and then he passes right in danger. So he has. <sighs> Fuck me. No, no, it's tackle, rackle. There's a rackle and a, and a claw pump. 
Yak is just insane, isn't he? Brilliant. <laughs> Brilliant to watch. <laughs> Brilliant to watch Yak just being an absolute mentalist. <laughs> right, so his plan is to just get everybody to everybody in his team hit by two dice blocks. And uh, hope it works. Woo! <laughs> Yeah, he just three dies his image with powers of yeah. There was no need to set up the serve. I mean, obviously he couldn't. There you go, instant cast. Like, he couldn't afford to serve him when he can just make all these juicy 2D hits. This is, this is bonkers, isn't it? What the fuck? I would love to know what is going through Yak's head now. <laughs> what was his... What is he thinking? <laughs> I mean, by not playing like a complete fucking idiot, Wolfenator, that would help. That would help, number one. Um, but... <laughs> but, um... Yeah. <laughs> this looks like collusion, yeah. <laughs> yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe he just wants to go back to bed. <laughs> I just don't understand what this plan was. <laughs> what is? <laughs> it's just bonkers, isn't it? It's just bonkers. I mean, the, 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 actually, the the chaos team isn't that bad against elves, right? He's only got the tackle bomber. That's the only guy you got to worry about, unless you base everybody. And let it, let him tee off on you guys. Like, if you had just ran back and then stayed back, <laughs> he would have taken no hits yet. <laughs> but instead, he's had a guy killed. <laughs> and that poor used. And, uh, yeah. And whatever that happens here. Not piling on. I guess now because because Andre's got such a good stop of like got such a good chance of just stopping Yak's score, <laughs> it discourages pylons. <laughs> so it, it's done something good. Yak's turning over. He can he can blitz this guy now and like KG or something, can't he? <laughs> it's a classic old men's elf offense. Yeah. And this is a very weak point, isn't it? You could say this was bad from Andre, but okay, he shot it up with a pow. Instant full 1D pow. Blockless 1D death. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, that's disgusting. <laughs> the kind of one alright thing Yak did <laughs> gets punished. <laughs> The one all right basing of that entire turn gets punished by a blockless one day into death. <laughs> and it was a full pile, so even if he did it with one of his Rogers, he would have got screwed. <laughs> amazing. Absolutely amazing. <laughs> God, I tell you what, <laughs> these Jacks games are entertaining, aren't they? Flip me. Absolutely bonkers. Yeah, he's got six moves, hasn't he? So one, two, three, four, five, six. He can get up there. Um. And then he goes one, two. Oh, no, yeah, okay, so he's just gone through this way on twos. Go through there and tackle, because otherwise, this guy could have double GFI to get there. So it's the same way, really, you're just making two, two pluses, but this way. Oh, okay, he's leaping. He's leaping. Literally worse. <laughs> okay, yeah, it's just literally worse, isn't it? Two plus, two plus is better than a three plus. 
um, in every way. There you go. <sighs> you can get to Chalice with any team playing like this as long as you, as long as you're as good at Blood Bowl as Yak. Yeah. Oh, yes, yeah, so it's a two plus leap. Oh my god. I saw that the dodges were two pluses, two pluses, and didn't see that the leap was a two plus. What the fuck is wrong with me? Yeah, I, I, I'll, I'll be honest, it's 9.40 a.m. right now. I've just rolled out of bed and started streaming, and I literally thought it's a three plus leap or two two plus dodges because he's at five. What the fuck is that? What, what on earth was I thinking? I mean, to be fair, it's yak, right? So. I wouldn't have been surprised if he'd made two two pluses instead of instead of if if he'd made one three pluses instead of two two pluses. Wouldn't surprise me. But like he's he's good at blood bowl. He just does some crazy fucking things sometimes, doesn't he? And and this is one of them. I had an, I had a banana as well. There's lots of sugar in, in bananas. Isn't there? I do have sugar free alcohol. I've got a cup of tea. But um, you know this is hard. This is this is really hard. Wow, Chuck. Cutting me deep. Cutting me deep. I'd have Dimmy in the booth if he wanted to be. That'd be glorious. Dimmy, do you want to come in the booth? Dimmy! I'll, I'll put my headset on and everything for you. Help me, in my humble opinion, one of the best commentators that I've ever heard in my life. If the dimster would grace us with his presence, that would be amazing. Oh my god, alright, it's on. It's on. Quality of the stream is, is about to uh, increase exponentially. <laughs> oh baby. Alright, I'm in commentary. Let's go champ. <laughs> oh, there's the pile. He's got piles, but it doesn't work. And he's he's let Yak off the hook a bit here, hasn't he? He's got he's got two plus out there on that corner, and he's got the leap out as well. He's got the leap to safety because I know now that he leaps on a two plus. Woo! Jim, good at blood ball. <laughs> where's where's the picture of Dimmy? <laughs> Morning, Jim. Oh, good morning, Dimmy. How's it going, mate? Not bad, not bad. I've just got out of bed. How are you? <laughs> I've just got out of bed as well, to be fair. I stayed up playing some games last night. It's pretty mad. Cool. I'll tell you what, this looks, this looks rough for Andre, doesn't it? <laughs> <laughs> looks a nightmare for him, yeah. I don't know how he's going to win. I have no idea. <laughs> You should drop the GG. How many hours are we at now? Uh, about seven. Not Good that bad. Well. No, not eight. Eight. Not that bad, really. It's not. It's <laughs> mental, isn't it? <laughs> it's completely mental. Do it! Glorious. Glorious. It's a nice little team that uh, Andre's got as well, isn't it? He's he's kind of snuck by me a bit. I'm jealous. Yeah. Yeah, it's not bad that he's got a move four guy somewhere. I think it's claw pom is move four. Yeah, that's a bit that's a bit ropey. Oh yeah, it? the only one that needs movement. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <Move past. laughs> yeah, but yeah, the strength five block guard stand firm is pretty great, isn't it? Another guard stand firm. Some claw mighty, full claw he's pom got, tackle rackle. These guys are right at the bottom of the bracket, aren't they? So who are they looking at? Um, the winner of this. We'll Cruised. play the winner of El Duderino and uh, Drag, I believe. No, El Duderino and Drag play Singolo. <laughs> oh, okay, well, I've that... got no idea then who they play. They I think it's Cruz. It's I not think Cruz. It might... Is it it's not? Because not Cruz. Cruz is playing uh, Sindane. Oh, Orcs, yeah. So, yeah, there must be another one. I'll check it in a minute. I'll just... 
Jackal doing its job there. I mean, he's, he's like, despite his first three turns of complete insanity, he's he's, he's not in a bad position yeah, now. No, yeah. Should have leapt, shouldn't he? he should have, like, this time he should have leapt. Like, he should have leapt anyway, but he should have definitely leapt. It was just like, how does he make that mistake after not doing it before? Oh, no. Yeah, because, it, it, okay, this guy doesn't have tackle, but you've got to make a dodge away from tackle. You might as well leap and save yourself one in 36, mightn't you? Uh, okay, so the winner of this bit plays either Veli or Sasori. Nah. And then it's the winner of that one then goes to Crucible or something. So yeah. It's, it's the bottom half. Yes. Bottom quarter. Yeah, yeah, he, yeah, this is the bottom quarter. Yeah. I, I was in like the third quarter. Is Yak the last elf? I think Yak may be the last elf. Well, without spoilers, Velahopia was in this round as well, but uh, with spoilers, he fucking lost. <laughs> oh, did you watch that game? Yes. Oh, I, yeah, I haven't watched it, but I can see it on Spike. <laughs> <laughs> so, well, spoilers. It's pretty mad, though, isn't it? Because was it this... I don't know if it was last season. The season before, there was a load of elves. Yeah. And, uh, and this like, is orcs. This is like millions of orcs. For some it reason. is, yeah. And all the claw are like facing each other. It's mental, like. Because, mm. um, yeah, whoever wins this would be versus the spoilers, Jorfs. So, although, I don't know how many claw. Mate, Cru Cruz's team last night. Oh, oh my, holy moly. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Cru Cruz like, is in bad shape now, isn't he? He lost, what is it? A ball centaur, two Jorfs. Yep. And a hobo, a rookie hobo, the most important. Yeah, yeah, but the chops are perms, aren't they? So it's not only is the yeah. next game looking really hard um, and not unwinnable, but looking like he's going to lose now. Um, yeah. Even if he wins, he, he's gimped for the rest of the games. I mean, Sid Dame was pretty solid, wasn't he? He was pretty good. He was. I mean, he, he didn't have to do a lot, to be fair, against me. <laughs> I can't remember his <laughs> other game. But, uh, yeah, yeah, he, he didn't really have to play well against me. So, uh, But he certainly wasn't terrible. <laughs> he didn't give me the ball in the three turns before. That was, I had lost. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. It went to kicks. It went to kicks. Yeah. It was a great game. Watch the VOD. Watch the yeah, VOD. it was an incredible game, yeah. Incredible game if you haven't seen the Christopher game. I was quite impressed with uh, Zin. Zin 0 0, whatever. I mean, there was a few things that I was like, meh, but like. To do that well against Bruce was alright. Yeah. I mean, mo mostly it was just dice, wasn't it? Removing lots of yeah, players. Yeah, he smashed him to pieces. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that helps a lot when you smash. <laughs> when you smash the other Bash team to pieces. Um. <laughs> But I don't see the point of completely surrounding the fucking guy who couldn't leap away on a 2+, plus. but there you go. Yeah. Andre's getting a bit of whatever yak smoking, I think. <laughs> yeah, they're passing it around. <laughs> <laughs> I, uh... I mean, you don't really care if yak scores, right? But in this turn, anyway. Yeah. He's not going to score. I don't know, yeah, I mean, you wouldn't, you wouldn't particularly like it, oh, well, there you go. You wouldn't particularly like it, because it's not easy to score in three turns as Chaos, is it, against Elves with a Wizard. Um, it could be how you lose the game, but now that you've made another removal and it's, like, one of his best yeah. players, now, yeah, now you don't give a shit. Even if he lets you two turn, you don't care. And he's got the Wizard, though. Yeah. But he's just not going to have the players to do anything with it. Probably. A really weird ball carrier that he went block, short hands, tackle. Yeah, I think that's quite reasonable if you if you like forced into a carrier, like you know if you haven't got any if you haven't rolled the stats to make man, one, yeah. then then you just go like I mean he could have gone even short hands first, right? But if, if you take block because he's still hoping to get you know good things, then you can just go short hands. And then, then what are you going to take after that? I mean, I would have probably gone two heads first, but if you need, yeah, to that's what I was thinking. I would have gone two heads first, probably. Mm. But Hello, if you're lacking Ed, tackle, you're lacking tackle, aren't you? That's yeah. It's chaos's biggest problem, isn't it? In the early development, is tackle. 
Because you just want to get block and guard everywhere, don't you? So it's such an afterthought. And claw and mighty blow and piling on. Like, it's really hard. It's really yeah. super hard to get tackle. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and that's the thing. Orcs want to get loads of guard. But at least orcs, you know, start with all their block. And they, yeah, don't, exactly. and they don't get claw. So, so it's a lot easier for orcs to get to tackle than it is for chaos. And... Uh, yeah, yeah tackle is like second skill on a blitzer, isn't it? Whereas like on a goat, it's fourth fifth. or fifth. <laughs> yeah, fifth. yeah, yeah. <laughs> block, claw, mighty blow, piling on. Well, block, mighty blow, claw, piling on, tackle. So yeah, it's rough. <laughs> it's rough to get. Right? You could go block tackle like show me, but uh, it's not for me. Oh, that was hilarious. Didn't he? Didn't he moan about that quite a bit? He didn't. I, I moaned about it. I was, uh, oh, I, yeah, you had the block tackle go, didn't you, that you hated? <laughs> yeah, I really hated it. <laughs> I just remember watching you stream that Chaos team just go, ah! <laughs> didn't you just end the whole team and start it again? Yeah, I did, yeah, I just deleted them. <laughs> they had a fine record and everything. I was just like, oh, fuck off. <laughs> yeah. I didn't go Mighty Blow first on everything. <laughs> yep. He's just gonna pass from there, yep. From He's got nose of steel. Woo! What is it though? Four? Fours, yep. There you go. It's the tuddy. Oh, he... I mean that's incredibly risky in itself, like four it is, plus. Yeah. Is it seventy five percent of the rerun? Yep. So you, you basically lose the game one in four times there. <laughs> yep. <laughs> I don't think I have much choice. It was the player that I would have gone for as well. Though, though it's probably the one player I would have made the same as Yak this match. <laughs> oh, you, you mean you wouldn't have all managed him? <laughs> uh. no, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't have practiced the face to face technique, no. <laughs> Jack was just thinking, I'm going to smash his fists in with my face. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> <laughs> that was something, wasn't it? That was an innovative offence. <laughs> is, is he not even going to try and stop the score? Oh, my God. Uh, I don't know. Well, he's got... Yeah, he's not going to use the wizard, is he? So, I don't know. I don't like this. I mean, I think he, he should be going up and trying to use the wizard and turn over and score in two, you know. But he's not going to. He's just going to get 2-1 grinded. Woo! He's not getting any more players ever in the game. He's, he's got no kills, so he's got eight men max for the rest of the match. So put them yeah. upfield and, and try and bez forward with everybody and then and then use the bolt and go 2-0 up at half-time and then fucking hang on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I guess, and the, the thing is, is he could lose like three players here, and then he's got five players with a wizard next half exactly, <laughs> instead yeah. of eight. Yeah, yeah that's exactly, true. Yeah. Hello, backyard dodo. Yeah, that's that's the thing. You're on a clock. You're on a massive clock against uh, against like. Oh, I've got teams. a massive clock, Jim. <laughs> <laughs> I said you're on a massive clock, Jim. So what you what you get up to? <laughs> None of my business. <laughs> <laughs> um, just put it this way, I'm standing up right now. <laughs> oh, dear. oh, that's a nice kick, isn't it? This is just brilliant yak tactics, you know. Don't bother defending, get a perfect that kick. So that you can't miles score. away from the ball. <laughs> See, but if he put if he put his men up here, he, and you know, if there's a misfield, he swarms through. You know, Blitz, it could be horrific. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I think he had to give himself that chance. Yeah. I, it's really weird that he was so happy to base like that turn <laughs> three. <laughs> and now he's, now he's at the point where he's not, obviously not basing, but <laughs> he's decided to stay as far away from the ball as possible. Yeah, brilliant. I mean, Yak always, Yak always bangs on me. Every time I played Yak, he's absolutely annihilated me. But um, one of those was his 1000 TV Underworld against my 1000 TV Chaos team. Ah. And he had about seven Claw Mighty Blow. <laughs> <laughs>
Yeah, it pisses me off that elves throw the bones that are kicking it as well. Yeah, it, it, that really winds me up. That really winds me <laughs> up. It's called kickoff, and they just lob it. Yeah. Does he pom here? Does he go for the 3D blitz to pom? I would. <laughs> yeah, I why, would too. why not? <laughs> why yeah. not? Yeah, I think I think he should. But, I mean, it, more more scoring threats is the reason not to, isn't it? And to not roll the <laughs> not roll the triple both down. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Well, I mean, it's it saved him the uh, one in nine pickup, isn't it? So genius strats there from Andre. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Yeah. So he's already at the point he's got a hand off to score, right? Isn't he? So. Yeah. <clears throat> I would pass. I would just literally pass this turn. Because. Just to get the ball to like the halfway line. Yeah, well, like you, you wouldn't. You can't go that wrong with it. Um, you know, you've got no rerolls or whatever, but at the end of the day, even if you like, even if you fail and pick up, you still pick it up eight times out in nine next turn, aren't you? <laughs> yeah, I guess. I guess. <clears throat> but then, like, I'd also like to have the. Uh, Sure hands guy further forward, like the halfway line. Yeah. So I don't, <laughs> I don't know if I would pass. Yeah, I guess you could have him like six ahead. Yeah. And then just hand off to him next turn. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But on the other hand, if you pass to him, he gets over the halfway line and he's in perfect range to score. Yeah, that's if he catches it. Yeah. Whereas if he doesn't catch it, then he's even further away, and he's got a hand. He's got hand off. Well, yeah, six. But you could hand off yeah. to someone else, couldn't you? So. Oh yeah. Who cares? <laughs> like that. That'd be my thinking. Next turn, you could just uh, you could just go and pass it to this guy over the next turn. I think it probably would have been worth it. Maybe if you had two rerolls, maybe it would be more of an idea. Because like this is what three GFIs to score now, hand off and three GFIs. Yeah, it must be so frustrating to like actually have quite a difficult like three turn, despite the fact that Yak made no effort to defend it whatsoever. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's just like I'm not going to score anyway. Like <laughs> just just cause the kick was perfect. Yeah. Yes. He's just going to get his edge guy like absolutely trounced him. Yeah, I think he is. Yeah. It's not going to get him core pond, but I, I guess you rattle him. But then if you rattle him, you're not going to hurt him. And you can sidestep and occupy other players, so maybe you just rattle someone else. <laughs> I think uh, rattle is one of the deadliest skills in the game, though, Jim. <laughs> it killed a, a very nice werewolf in uh, the Bright versus Dudorino yeah. game. Yeah, that was insane, wasn't it? <clears throat> All it needs to be is make sure it's a 1D and then it's guaranteed to just be complete death. That is a good point. Hello, Bella Hoppy. <sighs> Morning, Belly. Boy, howdy. And he's got to get his scoring threats, hasn't he? How many scoring threats has he got at the moment? Kind of two. Yeah, not on... Kind of three. Problem is as well, is he's actually got to protect the ball in the middle. Like, and I don't know, because you're not going to get it to the scoring threat. And then Yak's got like two, well, a one leaper now. Is that one leaper? Two leapers, so... You've got to actually protect the ball in the transition as well. Which is he's got a G5 with this guy, hasn't he? He's got a like... Yeah. Double G if I'm here or something. Uh, to here. Yeah, yeah maybe he's going to try and 
I think he might try and hand it off to him and then run him up, but then I don't know about that either, because... I guess if it fails, it fails. Yeah. One, two... Is it a G if I had to hand off? No, no, he's, he's six <laughs> away. But it's he's got to do one. He's probably got to do both GFIs and just start himself in contact. I mean, yeah, that's the thing. Yak's not scoring, is he? So it doesn't matter if he fails the handoff. It just means he's less likely to score. So yeah, it's done alright, I guess. But then, yeah, like you say, who is the scoring? Like all these scoring threats are based, aren't they? At the moment. Yeah. I think the strength five is probably the best scoring threat, just because he can't take him down, and he should be able to free him up. Yeah, I mean, he should be able to free anyone up. Actually, like he's got he's got a lot of blocks there to free people up, so he's it's not looking bad. I don't know if you re-roll this hand though. He might have to because the edge five can just pick it up. It doesn't matter. Because like, if he failed it, the edge five could have just run through and picked it up, couldn't he? And then lobbed it. Yeah. I think you make the second one. Yep. Doesn't make the second one. Uh, Boy, so it's doubles. Mm. So now you can get one deed from this direction. Um, but that wouldn't push him back, and you'd like quite like to push him back, wouldn't you? As yak. Is he gonna scream this? Really? <laughs> <laughs> Seems a horrible idea. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know about this. No offence to Yak, but some of the things he does, I just cannot understand. <clears throat> he just doesn't have enough to screen this in any shape or form. No, all he can do is 1D him. Just leap in and 1D him. Hope for the best. That's like all there is. That's literally all there is here. It's a bit weird that he moved that guy and then there's a pause, because you, you think that you... Like you have a plan, and you, know, you make your plan, and then you act, you don't just move one dude and then stop. Like. <laughs> yeah, yeah, playing like the AI by just moving and then thinking for a minute. Uh, yeah, Yak is just as yeah, yeah. And that's the thing; he's got like sure hands and leaps, so he could have been some sort of recovery, maybe. Yeah, yeah maybe. So, I mean, it's very, like, optimistic, <laughs> optimistic <laughs> yeah. thinking, but, like, picking up the ball is just so good, isn't it? It's just, it adds another failure state for your opponent. Yeah. And you can just lob it as well, which helps. Uh, so he's gone for the screen. Yeah, but he can't, like, he can't, he, like you say, he can just... I guess it means that Andre has to hand off. Unless he's going for the screen and the sack, but... Yeah, maybe he is. Because that wrestle guy has got to make the free up two up. Otherwise, this is completely pointless. Man, he's got, he's got, he's got the sidestep here. So, oh, uh, look, he's made the roll so far. Yeah, he's gone, uh... He's got in, he's got his 1D. Gets the push. Ho ho ho, see you yeah, later. Oh no, he's gone from the wrong... Oh, is that guard, that guy there? Yeah, yeah, he couldn't He couldn't hit. I mean, he could have uphilled to just push him back, I guess. He could have just yeah. uphilled, maybe that was the play. Oh no, he's getting... Oh no, he can't surf him, can he? He can't surf him, no, and he's, he's sticking... He's going to stick to him like glue. That is annoying as hell. Did you just forget the touchdown, Jim, and pom the edgy? <laughs> <laughs> yep. <laughs> I mean, I think, you, I think you score the touchdown and pom the edgy, right? Just pom the edgy and then one, two, three, four, five, six, hand off to him, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, GFI. It's yeah. all right, isn't it? It looks good to me. So, yeah, pom it, and then it's just a three plus two plus, right? Yeah. In fact, you could, you could you could hit this guy first, and you've got then you've got three dice on the on the side stepper. Yeah, three dice blitz, and just make sure you look him over. Easy. Oh, that's yeah. <laughs> How many times have you just been like, oh yeah, if this powers, then this is really nice. <laughs> yeah, yeah, just power him, just power him easy. 
18 dice later, still looking for a pal. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> three three dice is guaranteed, pal. We we all know this. <laughs> oh man, don't say that, Jim. <laughs> What's he thinking? What he could do is he could just try to two D him first with the uh, with the warrior. With the claw, yeah. Just fish for and a then, pal. yeah, and then it means he can blitz the uh, wrestle stripper, and then it means that he doesn't even have to geofire, doesn't it? Once yeah. Yeah, I don't like moving that guy in first because I would like to have handed off and scored on him, um, rather than the dirty player. That really matters too much. Yeah, at this stage in the competition, like, he's only going to play one or two more games on this team. Yep. So oh, now he's going to... Why did he... He could have just sidestepped in between and... Oh, no, because then he has to go around the back. Which means then he has to hit the blockless block on the pro elf, doesn't it? Yeah, I think he had to sidestep there, yeah. Or is it double... Yeah, it is, yeah. Unless he's thinking that he wants to stop him coming down the side. Yeah, that was... Yeah, I guess yeah, I was thinking of the double GFI. He hasn't blitzed yet. But no, but like, he, he just needs to yeah. just blitz him for a push and it's a 3 plus to score. He's blocked. Oh, okay, he didn't block off first. Yeah, he, he, blocked, he blocked the claw pump hit on him, but obviously get, the push was no good there, so this, he definitely should have blocked this one. He absolutely should have sidestepped the other way. Because those pushes wouldn't have been good enough against this guy, would it? He just yeah, first. yeah, yeah, yeah. True, true. So yeah, it was, that was, you know, without being mean or harsh, that was a mistake by Yak. He was thinking of that sideline play, <laughs> he should have been thinking of that handoff play. Dicing himself. Yeah. Just roll pals. <laughs> Just roll pals. What is a pal, Jim? <laughs> what is a pal? <laughs> They're these things that other people roll. Um... This mythical <laughs> result on the dice. <laughs> So now he's got seven. How did he have eight before and now he's got seven? He must have had nine before and I just thought that was it. So he had nine before. That was really quite good, wasn't it? <laughs> nine is, yeah, nine is okay. But now? Uh, it's better than seven, yeah. Yeah, now he's down to seven and now he's got to try and defend. He's got the wizard though. And like mm. Andre, yeah, uh, I don't know. Like it's, it's really easy for Yak to hit the ball but well not with the guard I guess yeah it's yeah I mean he can just bolt him can't he jump in with the agi guy and then lob it so it's um, not if he puts the agi guy on the other west to get claw pumped uh, <laughs> <yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> oh, him, yeah, that is true what? <laughs> I have no idea what's going on yuck you've got one guy to protect dude <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's, it's starting to look a little colludy. <laughs> oh, I don't know what's going on. <laughs> what the fuck? Like, okay, if he gets pushed, it's nice to sidestep back. But he's obviously going to blitz you as well. And, and they, foul uh, you. And there's a rookie, like, right behind him. Yeah, uh, yeah, oh, exactly. Minimize the cast. Yeah, yeah, so he doesn't want to... But yeah, but that's your is... best player. You could put the Roger there, couldn't you? You could put the Roger. Yeah, there. anyone except your literal best player that is your one way to win the game. <laughs> like <laughs> He has a wizard. He's just, he's just madness, isn't it? I think. I don't know. Yeah. He's an absolute mad lad. I mean, like, he's not even, he's AV8 as well, isn't he? So he's not even immune to claw. You can't even give him that excuse. Yep. Powers him instantly. <laughs> yep. <laughs> he's got upon that. Yeah. Right. Nothing. Nothing. But he can he can go over and foul him later. Yeah, I think I would. Like I I I get the feeling like if you remove that guy, you've pretty much won the game. Is yeah. pretty much my thinking. Yeah, mine too.
Punch the wrestle, man. Come on, we haven't got all day. <laughs> oh, I hate that. He could have pushed him and then pushed him again, couldn't he? And push, like if you draw uh, the push. I know, I know what I know what the pause was there. The pause was Jack going, "You powered me, Blodger, in chat," and then Andre, Andre just replying with, "Ja ja 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 ja." <laughs> Almost certainly that's what happened. Yeah, that's definitely what happened. <laughs> definitely what happened, guys. Inside knowledge. <laughs> Only a push, though. Yax, LOS somehow survives. Yeah, you'd be a bit, she'd like, a bit like, oh, this is frustrating. Oh, he's got the dirty player foul yet, so. I think he'll foul next turn, to be honest. I think he'll just move up and. Yeah, it's ball. stunned, isn't it? Yeah. Elliot's been telling telling me to stop fouling stunts, but mm. I still foul him. <laughs> <laughs> I still foul him. Oh, he's not moving up. We well, could get himself no into way. trouble here by not moving up. I think. I think that's like okay. You know, if you move up and, and he gets a wizard from the gods, it's bad. But you can get yourself into trouble by not moving up as well. Yeah, because the thing is, is right. Yak's just going to push forward on both flanks, and then. If the wizard works, he's in scoring range, isn't it? Like for the next turn, I mean. Yeah. Where Genius play by Yak there, look. You get him sent off as well. Got him oh, sent man. Off. Yeah, made a removal. His first. His first. Chasm gym foul. Yeah, get, just. Tempt him a gym foul. Yeah. Unrowdy trust, twice. <laughs> yeah, trust Elliot to be unrowdy. <laughs> it's the funniest demo ever. <laughs> So yeah, okay, he floods through all five players in between these, what, three, six, seven players and the ball. Yeah, you blitz the Pommer on the way. Uh, oh no, the guard is there, so... The 1D. Oh no, that's 2. Yeah. He's, he's dodged. He dodged on tackle. I don't know why he didn't just 1D him, to be honest. Like, he might as well just straight up 1D him with Wrestle. And then... If you wanted him, like, because he had a 2 plus through the tackle anyway to hit there. Yeah, and now so, he's... So, your 2 plus that you've made the dodge might as well have been your blitz. Because if I you mean, push him, you still made he, the if, 2 plus for everyone else. If he did the 1D and got the wrestle, then he blocks the square. That's the problem, though, isn't it? No, it doesn't, because he's blocked that. This is the square he'd have wrestled from. The square that he's blocking anyway. Oh, right, yeah, of course it would be, yeah. yeah. So he should, he should and then if you push it. him, you push him out of the way completely, yeah. 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 He's got to go further before, yeah, I was going to say. Can't just stay there. And, and crucially, it lets you get this, this lineman through as well, you know, like it gets another player through. That's the big thing, isn't it? You've got to get. Oh, God, he's moved him first. Blocked his path. Is, does, he, he, does he have to GFI? Probably. Yeah. yeah. And this guy can come through. And it's not a lot. But it's something. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. No, he's the one. Oh, because he, he's taken the leap, On not dodge. <laughs> a double wand anyway. Just took a re-roll out with him. So, genius Andre play confirmed, uh, making Yak suicide for some player. Yeah. Now so he doesn't have to play at a foul, though, does he? No. He I, I mean. The corners, though. Yeah. He's got a bench. He needs a bench, I think, for the one turn defence. Yeah. Yeah, this is, this is going to get tricky now. Like not really. No, like you need eleven though, didn't you? For like the best one turn defense, you need eleven. Yeah, he, he can, he can like, he can you know get people like he can make like a layered cage kind of thing now. It's the best a layered, layered cake. Yeah, layer cake. Yeah, fucking what's he called? What's Daniel the dude Craig called? Craig. Yeah, Danny Craig. Do like a bit of Danny Craig actually. Too fair. Best Bond ever, just saying, just saying. Nah. Nah? Sean Connery? Roger Moore? Rog. Roger Moore. Mm. Rog is the best. Because it's a fucking stupid 
It like it's just this stupid fucking movies. Like they're so stupid. Yeah, I don't. I don't even like James Bond. To be fair. No, neither do I. They're, they're just so, so having having fucking Roger Moore is just better because he's just a fucking piss taken cunt, isn't he? Basically, like basically, if Elton was an actor, he'd be Roger Moore. <laughs> 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 yeah. Fucking brilliant. <laughs> ah, he's just going up the side then. Yeah, that's a good idea. Get as far away from this fucker as you can. Yeah, like, exactly, remove. isn't it? Yeah. I mean... <clears throat> Rog guy's not gone down. Is it... Yeah, I... Oh. Is this a wizard turn? I don't know. No. I don't know. No, I don't think so. I think you need the arch five. Which is why I didn't really like sacrificing him. <laughs> oh my god. Uh. <laughs> 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 he takes his tactical seagull suit. <laughs> oh, that'd, be, that'd be hilarious, wouldn't it? That'd be amazing. <laughs> Yeah, dog to the dog, enjoying that I'll let him find my best player to get a removal strategy. Yeah, yeah it was an interesting strat, wasn't it? Even a ducky fireball doesn't save him now, doesn't he? Even, even if he fireballs, he's saving yeah, no. the ball, what's he can do with it? I was just looking like he can get the Roger out on a 3 plus, 2 plus. But it, where he's not, yeah, he's just in trouble, isn't he? He's got no catches, has he? So he's got like no movement. Or is that guy a catcher? I think this one's a catcher. One. One catcher. And a blitz. Oh yeah, two blitzers and a catcher. Mm. Yeah, so I mean, like, he's on the floor, though. <laughs> so he's got, like, no move. He can't get away. No. This guy can, though. He can scream. There. There. And then this guy can, uh, can 3 plus 2 plus and get downfield. And this guy can, uh, okay, do something as well. Woo, flip me, guys. This looks brilliant. <laughs> it's solid defense from uh, Yak. Oh, that's I mean, nice. you got to feel sorry for him. Yeah, so it's, uh, that's no, that's true. Yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> that was a nice blitz, wasn't it, from Yak? That was. Yeah, that was yeah, nice. that's, that's what I do. Yeah, now you just run the catcher into scoring range, right? And then you're saying, look, whatever you do, I'm going to wizard next turn. Yeah. Yeah, he's he really is out of turns now. And, like, if you're Andre, do you just blitz the scoring threat and walk up the pitch? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but then you're exposing yourself to the edge five a little bit. Um, oh my god, what a foul. Ooh, beautiful foul. foul. This is the high rolly stage, isn't it? It's just like I've got nothing left. I, I might as well throw a foul. Yeah, but he's got the bribe still. So yeah, bribe works. And then what's he got? Like he appoed it. He appoed it. Well, he needs to tackle, doesn't he? Oh no, he's got tackle right next to this catcher. <laughs> yeah, he's got two tackles. Still. And like he's not, he's unlikely to take another Kaz, isn't he? With four four elves left on the field. <laughs> yeah, that's true. But yeah, the, oh, it's like you say, isn't it? It's, um, he needs to get the catcher out of scoring range. Yeah, I think you've, I think you've got to hit, hit him one, two, three, four, five. Um, no, but then you'd rather have the Rackler free to hit him if you have to. So yeah, I think you probably should have. What's the catcher? Is he going to 3D him and just stay in the danger zone just because he's away from the uh, match 5? I wouldn't hate that. Just put the ball back here. Yeah, he's got plenty of time yet, hasn't he? Yeah, if, if you keep the ball on this this line. He, he's got to worry about this tackle dude, though. Like, what, What's he doing here? Oh, he's just... Okay. <laughs> Some confusion is starting to set in now. <laughs> he fails. Oh, this is 100% a wizard, isn't it? Is it? Mind you, like, Yak's got the Adji guy a little bit too far back, I think. Yeah, yeah, but yeah, he has. 
I do that all the time. I always drop my safety like too deep, so it's not relevant. But then, like, you always don't want it too shallow because then it just gets hit. <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> so exactly. Like, yeah, it's such a fine balance. Does he foul here? He kind of has to, right? Because it's just think, too easy I to think, score. Well, like, I don't think he can foul because he has to. Can this touchdown is too easy. Like, it's, lit it's genuinely this is just too easy a touchdown. Just bolt the ball and then. Any he decent range? scatter, he can. Yeah, he's in range. He's 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 moving. This is this. Yeah, he's got a foul. He just literally has to foul. Ah, uh, you know it's gonna be a no armor break send off. <laughs> <laughs> is it a gym foul? Oh well, he got the armor break. Uh, <laughs> if that had been no armor break, he was he was he basically lost, right? I mean, not well, basically, probably but probably drawn. Yeah, and then had to go into. Uh, Overtime with like three players. Yeah. But that's lost his one turn of defense, like the perfect one turn of defense anyway. It's ten players now, isn't it? Yeah. Good point. Good point. Dibby! <laughs> Not just a pretty face, Jim. <laughs> Not even that, Dim. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> I'm not made of words. Made Sorry, words. I've always wanted to say that. Uh. Yeah, to me. <laughs> no, no, to anyone. <laughs> My whole life. <laughs> <laughs> to anyone, I was only joking. You're a fine figure of a man, Dimmy. <laughs> <laughs> it's alright, it's alright, Kill Bill. <clears throat> I, I, I'm used to it. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, and he can, he can, uh, I could just foul him again. <laughs> yeah, but he's, he's now he's got that tackle. I quite like dodging through and basing this tackle, and then he couldn't have hit, he couldn't have hit him with tackle. I preferred that to, to foul there. He could have dod dodged through in two plus, right, and tagged the tackler. And then he hasn't got tackle to hit your, uh, blood stepper. I think that was definitely the play, not that foul. I think that foul was useless. Yeah. But, I mean, it's quite easy just to... Oh, okay. But if he goes in, yeah, no, if he goes in there, then you can just chain push him. You can chain push the side stepper out by hitting the rookie, the, the one that stands in to block the tackle. But I guess, and you, yeah, if you push, then you still base to it. Yeah, yeah he could, he could, have, he could have filled in the squares like, like what he's done, but then it would have taken him another player, wouldn't it? And yeah, I think that was worth it, and mu much less chance of the, the blitzer going down as well. So I really that, did my attacking. This is... I think no matter what happens from here, this is 100% the wizard turn. Yes. Already. Yes, <laughs> yes. He's I'm definitely feeling, wizarding. I'm feeling confident that... <laughs> he has to go like a... Yeah, he has to do this kind of formation because otherwise it's getting fireballed and he could get really unlucky with the fireball. Yeah. And he can't... He's bought, don't he? Yeah. You bowl, leap in, lob it, pray. Yep. He can even clear the blitzer as well. Like he could wrestle the blitzer down and then. Yep. Bowl, leap in, nerves are still. Fall. This is like a really easy score. <laughs> yeah, it is. Yeah. Like, really easy. <laughs> it, it depends. It depends on like the the scatter on the bolt, but. Yeah. Yeah, like if the strength five catches it. <laughs> you feel bad. <laughs> oh, mate, yeah. Oh, wow. Well, what Yak could do is just stand up his catcher and then bolt. <laughs> <laughs> so, it is a bolt. It is a bolt. One tackle zone. One tackle zone. Where are we? Oh, that's the furthest one away. It right, is. so now we're wrestling down the tackle piece, yeah? We're wrestling yeah. down the tackle piece. Yep. Surely. I mean, maybe not. There's, a, there's there's the option just to just to go in. For oh, the, you could uh, you could just yeah, side. knock the guard off. Yeah, mm. that's probably better actually. Isn't it? And then just yeah, dodge no, out with the yeah. One, well, two, that's a one three, in six. Four, five, six, seven, and then like see if you can make some kind of cage thing. Oh, what not? Yeah, some kind of cage formation. Uh, there's two options, I would say. But whatever it is, it's, it's got to happen this turn. Something exciting. 
<clears throat> it's, it's when this happens, isn't it? You do your wizard and that, and then immediately you roll a snake. <laughs> <laughs> Just like, ah! Yeah. Blood ball! Yeah, this is, I mean, even if he act scores, I guess the cage is better, right? The cage is much better than scoring. If you can maintain the cage and then score late, yeah, like, if, if it leads to a touchdown, it's definitely better. If it leads to getting turned over and losing, it's not, it's not better. But yeah, it's like, can you stop him scoring in four turns with the players you've got? Maybe not. We could do the pass to a cage as well, that's an option, isn't it? Or just pass to a potato. Yeah, yeah. oh, this is good, isn't it? You can just potato, he doesn't even need to score, right? He could just, he could just like, uh, he could just pass it to this guy. Just potato. Because he can't get hit by a tackle. If he's in this, in this, you know, rank file, whatever you want to call it. Yeah. If, he, if he gets on this, on this, on this row, column. No, not there, that's not good. Mm, no, that's the that's the wrong square. I'm not sure who's because if he's passing it to this guy, this guy isn't here. He's giving it to wrestle. Well, I guess it doesn't matter if he gets the ball down. He's not getting it back. Oh, <laughs> <That's> disgusting! <laughs> disgusting. Yeah, this, I mean, this is the wrong ball because he could have just he could have just hit him with the hit him with the tackle. You can't just you can't just hit him with tackle. Like he he had to be here. I mean, Yak did all right there. To be fair, he did. Like considering the way the game's gone, like he he had an opportunity to win it. Yeah, this guy had to be here though. He just had to be because he was getting bits by tackle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you had to you had to not get bits by tackle. <laughs> But it was nice that there would have been like a screen and uh, and everything, but he, he had to be there. I mean, some annoying dice mean this isn't over yet. But would have leaped it's... out 100%. Yeah. The leap out means 3 2 pluses, though. So the leap yeah. out is, is pretty dangerous. Like, it does put you in a super strong position with like. Uh... In fact, you're better off just dodging out anyway. The dodge out is better than the leap out. Yeah, because you got the inbuilt reroll. Yeah, that's just a three plus with a reroll. That's that's really that's really that's really good. The three plus with a reroll, and then the two plus, and then another two plus. Yeah, I think I think the dodges out was the best. Well, it's, yeah, one in nine instead of one in six, isn't it? Yeah. Which is what I always forget, and uh, do it the wrong way around. <laughs> and it normally works <laughs> because that's how proper works. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if you do the wrong play, it will work. If you do the correct play, he's dodging now. Yeah, he's got to, hasn't he? he does Oof. Could have lost the game right there, couldn't he? Easily. Now we've got the uphill uphill wrestle strip. No, he's got nothing left, does he? Yeah, he's got uphill wrestle strip. That's, that's not even bad. He hasn't. He's he's got it off the show hands, or at least with that bolt. So yeah, that sudden now this wrestler can can pop the balls. Leap in. Oh, he hasn't got a leap. Dodge in. <laughs> <laughs> Dodge in and uphill in with strip. But, like, uphill with wrestle strip is pretty fucking good odds. Really good odds. What are the odds, interestingly? Uh, like, about 90% if you've got a reroll. What, including the dodge? Not without. No, the, the uphill with wrestle strip. Is... Ah, okay. <clears throat> yeah, the dodge makes it hard. The dodge is the hard part. Yep. <laughs> and now it's gone. GG. But it was a good effort by you. It was. An exciting second half. <laughs> Especially after the <laughs> his insanity dug himself into such a big hole. <laughs> he's, he's obviously school of adversity, isn't he? School of adversity, so... <laughs> He, he just didn't want to play the game with uh, 11 players, thought that was far too easy. <laughs> uh, made sure uh, he, the odds were firmly stacked against him before he started playing Blood Bowl. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Barney Kilsey. Hello, Kilsey. 
Oh, it was the easy mode. Ooh, you say that. <laughs> it's Traperis. <laughs> <laughs> say that. So... I, I, I don't think I would agree with that. No. <laughs> I... <laughs> Play one game of Prowess against Dwarves and then tell me they're easy mode. Yeah. No, play one game against Prowess and tell me they're easy mode. <laughs> yeah, to be fair, I always like spinning against Prowess, especially in CCL, because like, you, you know when they score in two turns that you're going to win. <laughs> yeah. It's like, like nobody, like, it's like nobody like, teaches people how to play Prowess, so it's like every time I spin into Prowess, they literally try and two turn, and I don't even care. <laughs> like, yeah. It's just like... Oh no, I can't stop your... your, your oh yeah, oh, oh, oh damn, now I've got 14 <laughs> turns of punching you in the head. <laughs> <laughs> You're all armor 7, oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's, What's my breakup looking like? Let's have a look. Um, yeah, I've never seen you play Pro Wheels, Jim, actually. No, I played them. I haven't, I haven't done that well against them, actually. One, two. One, two, three, four, five. Th my sixth, sixth best record against. Better record versus Pro Wheels than versus Underworld. <laughs> is, it, is it your record versus Birds, which is the best? Yes. Yeah. Yes. My record versus Birds is insane. Are you tipping for Blitz Pit, by the way, Jim? Rick. <laughs> really? Yeah. <laughs> I suppose I suppose there's no real way of not thinking that. Like, especially after Oh baby. Super League and uh He still hasn't oh. lost without Orga team. <laughs> like fucking Has he not Oh games. yeah, of course he hasn't. <laughs> in about eight games he still hasn't lost. Like it's fucking how do you bet against him? Mate, the worst thing is, is since he's done that I've been spinning into like 1500 ogre teams in CCL. <laughs> I'm like, I'm like, I'm sure this is Rick's fault. I'm sure this is Rick's fault. Yeah. Um. I hate ogres. I hate playing against ogres. Just, I'm instantly tilted. <laughs> it depends what the team is. I quite enjoy playing them with my high elves, <laughs> beating them oh, seven yeah. one. <laughs> yeah, high elves. I'm always bashed though, aren't I? So it's just a nightmare. Uh -huh. Maybe you shouldn't be bashed, Jimmy. Maybe you should try high elves. I you... did, I did. I nearly qualified with high elves, but the server ate a game, so I didn't. Mm. Yeah, sad times. I, well, I was like one win away, and then I lost three in a row. <laughs> <laughs> I always get to that one more game, and I'll qualify, and then I'll just lose three in a row. And it's just so sad. Rough. It's normally at 2 a.m. on a Saturday night. <laughs> 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 one eye open, <laughs> slouched in my chair, scre screaming at dice. If my bowl was fun and swear, everyone would be playing dwarves. Yeah, well, they will be in uh, in about two months' time. <laughs> yeah, maybe. In about two months' time, it's the year. It's the. It's the it's, I, like, I hope they realise what a terrible meta mistake this is, and they just overhaul it. But they won't, obviously. No, they won't. They definitely won't. Well, G I mean, doesn't care about it. G yeah, no, no, no. I'm not on it. Yeah, it's G. What's it? Probably not. I, I probably will give him a try, but I'll probably play. I want to play like. Uh, if the corner in it, I want to give them a go because I've seen them play them before. And, corner um, won't be out for a while. Or... Oh, is it? So yeah, obviously everyone's going to be playing Black Orcs for like the first week as well until they realise they're actually pretty crap because half the team are goblins. Yes. Yes. <laughs> so everyone's going to go, this is amazing! And then like 10 games in, they're going to be like, no, I've had enough of this. <laughs> yeah, yeah, obviously Black Orcs are going to be shit. But yeah. everyone's pretty hyped for them because they're a genuinely new team in football, aren't they? Yeah, I am hyped. I am hyped for Black Orcs. And I like Orcs anyway, so <laughs> it should be alright. It's basically like a hybrid Ogre Orc team, isn't it? In a sense, like, yeah. strongest Snotlings. It's like, it's like uh, Lizards if Lizards would absolutely shit. I think Lizards are going to be, well, pretty bad, aren't they? With, um, the change of the cost of the roster, so like when they start, they can't even afford all their Saurus, can they? No, they, they start with one reroll now, which 
A one reroll with all the Saurus. Yeah, and the cross. It's horrific. That's yeah. horrific. Yeah, it's pretty bad to start with one reroll, but you know, if they roll if they roll alright, they'll still get a yeah. decent start and then they'll get they'll <laughs> yeah. get a third second reroll, then they'll get the third reroll. And then if there's redrafting they can redraft it down to, you know it, no. with good players they can redraft down to two and it'll be fine. So well, you just get rid of all your skinks, don't you? And just start again. Yeah, exactly. Let's play with them. Yeah, they'll, 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 the one reroll with no block means they won't get to reroll the the handoff to the Saurus in the second half. <laughs> well, no, no, sorry, the, they won't get to reroll the handoff to the Saurus when after they've turned you over. <laughs> <That's> yeah, <laughs> and the thing is, is you can pick doubles on skinks now, can't you? So yeah. you can just literally get a blood skink or a short and hand stats skink. and stats as well. You just you just guarantee to get movement, strength, or edge on your skink. Just... Yeah, it's going to be like, there's going to be loads of super skinks in there. It's just going to be one super skink in every team. Yeah. Because you'll just keep scoring on him, wouldn't you? You'll give him, like, block or something, and then you'll just power level him. Yeah, we'll just, just roll for just roll for stats on him, and then if, if like, if you don't roll large, give him block. And then, yeah. and then roll for roll for edge on him, and if you don't roll large, give him sure hands. And then... Not just plus edge, not just plus edge kills. Okay, you've got to roll for it. You have to roll for the. You have to roll for the stats. So seeing as you have to get the edge by rolling. Isn't it like fifteen or something? It's a D sixteen, isn't it, or something? Yeah, weird. yeah, it's a sixteen-sided dice, and like about I don't know, like, like three or four of them are edge. Yeah, like twelve to fifteen, I think it is. I'll have a look. I'll tell you in a minute. Right, let let's finish this YouTube video first, though. Do it. <laughs> <laughs> well, it was an easy win for Andre, as probably you know. That, that's a de facto kind of result you'd expect, isn't it? Really, loads of armor breaks, massacre them, two one grind. Uh, but you know, Yakar did decent shot with the wizard, didn't he? With very few players yeah. left, he, he, he did. He did do some very good things, Yak. But of course, he did some. He did some crazy things as well, <clears throat> as is standard for Yak. I mean, like if you think of it, like that that intercept was a six plus. So like five times out of six, this game probably goes to overtime and well maybe not even overtime maybe yak wins it so it was very close jim yeah it was yeah in the end so there you go maybe, maybe don't try the face to fist next <laughs> technique next time though yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah so we did learn that basing uh chaos warriors with claw mighty blow with av7 um pro offices <laughs> dangerous <laughs> Yeah. Hello, Yak. Oh, Yak. The worst one was the the, the, the smartest base, which was the, the which was the day. skillless guy that was like holding the whole thing down. You know, he was holding like the biggest area on one player, and that one base made like all of the rest bad bases worth that one good base. You know, if you were thinking of it positionally, and yet he just one dice killed him. <laughs> that was hilarious. Uh, well, for us, it was hilarious, not for Yak. <laughs> 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 oh, I was like, what's, what's he gonna do here? Oh, he's just gonna power him. Oh, he's dead. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, oh, he should have should have got someone behind him because he can't afford to take this. Oh, yeah, he can afford to take this hit, and he's just he's just <laughs> cast him and killed him. Unbelievable. <laughs> right. Yes, commiserations, yeah. Congratulations, Andre. Thank you very very much for joining me, Dimmy. It was great to have you on. No problem, mate. No problem. And uh, thanks for watching everyone, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.